Hello everyone. Welcome to the nursery. We've been working so hard on this. I wanted to give you a tour. Um, if this is your first time here, welcome to my channel. My name's Violet and uh, yeah, working on this room, we wanted to be as eco-friendly as possible. So I'm going to show you some of the things that we did. Um, but almost all of this furniture, actually, we were able to get completely second hand, which was so amazing and so, so, so helpful. Um, that's one tip is not buying things new, but it's also way easier on the wallet. And uh, we had so much fun meeting neighbors and uh, finding these things. So um, one thing though that I did get new was this bassinet. I was really excited to get this. And this isn't going to be in the room. It's actually gonna go downstairs in the living room um, as a spot for the baby downstairs during the day. Uh, but it's, you know, made with wood and organic cotton. Um, I need to tie all the little ties on here, but I just think it's so cute. And over here we have the changing table. Um, we're doing cloth diapering. So we're actually using the brand Best Bottom Diapers and we're able to get these organic cotton and hemp inserts. So these are the inserts that go into the diapers. And here are the diaper covers. So um, that's going to be really good. For the first week that we have the baby, however, we thought it'd be really helpful to have some disposable diapers on hand. So what we're using is this brand. It's called uh, Natty by Nature Baby Care. And these are all biodegradable diapers for newborns. It's made in Sweden. So that's what we did. Um, we're also able to get a lot of like secondhand clothes. And on our registry, we... Um, try to just put small shops and baby clothes made from organic cotton and eco-friendly brands. Um, these curtains and this moon uh, was handmade by my fiance's mother, so that's really special. These, uh, this mobile is from Etsy. And I just think it's so cute. It's obviously real sticks and um, these handmade birds. I just think that's so wonderful and I love supporting makers. So that was one thing that was on our registry. And then in here we've got a closet filled with things. We're able to get a lot of secondhand books as well, which was incredible. So I'm going to show you some of my favorite things in here. So these are some secondhand wooden puzzles that we got, but I wanted to include them because they're so cute. And I think wooden puzzles is a great idea of something to go for. So like I said, with our registry, we wanted to support eco-friendly companies and um, sustainable, ethically made, stuff made by makers. Um, so here are some things that we got off of it. And we used um, Babylist as our registry so that you could um, put on their places, like from many different stores. So we mostly did stuff from Etsy and the Package Free Shop and uh, some organic cotton clothing stores. But um, here we have this watering can. It is made by Green Toys and it's all recycled plastic. So we thought that that was really fun. And um, this is from Plan Toys Sustainable Play, but we've got this adorable rainmaker still in its box. These, it'll have to be a little bit older for. And then by the same company, this Banjo Lele. I'm an artist, so it was important to me to find crayons, and these are actually the only vegan crayons that I could find. So these are by Veggie Baby, um, 
and they're totally non-toxic and yeah they're all vegan and they're the only ones <laughs> so I went ahead and put those on the registry even though you know he'll have to be a little bit older for those now this is from the package free shop but uh, what we are using for bottling is this kid canteen brand so we're doing entirely breast milk um, but this is for if I need um, my fiance to feed instead so we got a couple of bottles in different sizes of kids canteen which hopefully they work really well also from the package free shop we got this wonderful wooden baby comb and here are some all-natural rubber teething toys I just thought they were so cute that they came in fruit shapes and let me tell you there were such a variety in choices of fruit shapes <laughs> so that was really fun this is also from the package free shop and lastly what I wanted to show from the package free shop is we ha we got these natural rubber pacifiers um, so we will definitely see how the baby likes them but I hope that he does because you know it's totally non-toxic and um, we'll see even if he ends up using pacifiers but just in case this is the kind that we got and they come in different sizes and here's a cute pacifier clip and these are some organic cotton baby rattles you can hear it uh, but we got three of these. This avocado was absolutely adorable. And this cactus is such a funny character. And this one we got secondhand, but it's the same brand. A little New York taxi. And we got a couple other organic cotton toys from Under the Nile. Um, that's also a brand where we got a, a lot of the new clothes from. But other than this, all of the other toys are hand-me-downs or second-hand. So this is just a start to our zero-waste, low-waste journey with baby. So if you have any tips or tricks, please let me know in the comments below. I would love to read about them. And thank you so much for watching this video and seeing a tour of what we've done so far. Um, I hope to see you next time.